Hello YouTube. We have a bit of a challenge. I have a, a friend who wanted me to try and duplicate a artist's own personal style. The artist paints in abstract, but he wanted me to try and copy his style. Not his particular painting, but the way he paints and his styles. And so the colors we're going to use, um, this client likes to have uh, primary colors, but basically everything on the outside of the uh, wheel here. The brighter uh, about here to here is what he looks. And he also likes blue, which will work on the chart here. Um, it's a cross from orange or red. I think, um, I think if I go with the cross from red or orange, you'll have the blue. So we'll use all these and the blue. So, let's give it a try. Let's see what happens if I can, if this painting, when it's done, will look similar to this other artist's painting. In other words, you couldn't tell the difference whether he did it or whether someone else did it. Very difficult to do because your arm movements and your manu mannerisms and the way you paint is different. Each artist has a little bit different length in arms, body movements, abilities, and so it's hard to mimic another artist, especially in abstract or very complex contemporary art. It's, it's, it's very difficult, but we're going to give it a try. Let's see what happens. Okay, I've made some sketches. This client likes thick paint. Thick paint it is. I also like thick paint. Let's give it a try. Start out with a base of yellow here in this area. And we'll, we'll have several layers of yellow here to really make it glow. Something about an abstract that's so relaxing. This is what we have so far. Let's see, we've been using basically primary cadmium yellow, li Liquitex. And now we're going to go over to this. This is a great product, this uh, Acrylic A642. Okay, and that's what it looks like. a very small canvas. You can see this paint is very difficult to work with, but once you get it down and in the right way, it really works well. This is an 8 by 10 inches. Well, there it is. I don't know where to... I don't know which category this goes in. Abstract, modern art, I really don't know. You guys can go ahead and give me an idea. Um, I'm also more and more 
on Twitter and you can get a hold of me by mbike triple five um, or just hit this link right here and that will get take you to my uh, Twitter account and you can uh, talk with me on that either way let me know what you think about the painting it's a very small painting it's an 8 by 10 let's talk about the paints to get the yellow this beautiful bright yellow I used Liquitex cadmium and then um, for the reds this excellent glowing red it was a combination of Liquitex cadmium red and then over the top of it I would use the Seleniar, Seleniar 692 and then I would alternate layers and that's how you get this glowing red about 20 different layers of, of paint um, I also used what I have left of this let's see if I can open that up there so you can uh, you're not going to be able to see it anyway Now for detailing, I found these little brushes right here. Which work beautifully. Okay YouTubers, there you go. Another successful painting. Let me know what you think. And uh, we have another painting ready to go. M-Bike, triple five.